the witness has moved beyond our reach. there is still hope. On Neptune, we learned that a key to defeating the Witness lies hidden away on Titan. Now we know why the Witness's fleet came there when it first arrived. Deputy Commander Sloan held the line on Titan to the bitter end, right up until the Witness took it. Then, we lost all contact. But now, just when we need it most, Titan has returned. And when it did, we were greeted with something we could have never predicted. To any Guardians listening, this is Deputy Commander Sloan requesting emergency support. This is the Priority One rescue operation. We have received a distress call on a secure Vanguard channel. The target of extraction is Deputy Commander Sloan. She was last seen on Titan before it vanished during the arrival of the pyramids. Our job is to triangulate where the distress signal is coming from, find the Deputy Commander, and get her out. I know what you may be thinking, but Sloan is one of the most tenacious, resilient soldiers I've ever known. If anyone could have survived this, it's her. The Guardian has landed. I'm at our old LZ. No sign of Sloan or enemy activity. Extraction team, what's your status? Commander, I am at the tidal anchor, not far from your position. It is abandoned. Quiet. The stress signal is weak. I've established a beachhead inside the new Pacific Arcology. No sign of the hive. Signal strength is weak here as well. Guardian. You need to cross the rig to align a communications dish so we can triangulate Sloan's position. Keep comms open. We don't know what happened here. Taken! I've got multiple Taken engagements on my position. <laughs> they are on me as well! Confirm 10 Taken contacts in the new Pacific Arcology. Iron War Beasts are engaging. Extraction team, status. All clear, Commander. Minimal casualties. Tidal anchor is secure. The Taken are gone. Guardian, get to the array. Is that the derelict? Hey, gang! Heard there was a party, and I thought I'd pop on by and see what the fuss is all about. This is a rescue mission for Deputy Commander Sloan. Get off the line. Oh, great. She owes me a drink. A drink? Would I lie? We have more taken incoming, falling back to the Arcology Solarium. I am the mountain upon which all swords sever! Hone your edge against me! No. I am the hand around your throat! I am the last breath in your mouth! You cannot escape me! 
More taken! They're coming up from the methane flush! I'm holding position! I remember Sagira shuddering! She was worthy of death! Osiris was not! Are you so fragile? Show your dumb! Fight me! I will tear you apart with my bare hands! That voice we heard... It was Sifu Arath. I'd only heard her voice in audio logs from the fall of the Cabal homeworld. There's no mistaking her. She must be near. We need to be careful. Her influence has never been this strong. We need to find Sloane and get her out of here now. You're almost at the Array Guardian. Get moving. Go! The Council's here at Siren's Watch say the Array is unpowered. Guardian, you need to find a way to reroute power, then properly align the Array's receivers. Excellent work. Systems are lighting up here. I have Sloane's position as... One kilometer down. She is in the ocean? It is a sea of crushing methane. Nothing can survive there. I wouldn't be so sure of that. Guardian, rig schematics show a ballast maintenance shaft near your position. Follow the signal down and find the deputy commander. I'll join up with you shortly. I've arrived at the diving point. I'm coming down to you. That ain't gonna happen, boss. Do you know how much pressure they're taking? They gotta get out of there. I am not leaving anyone behind again. And I ain't saying we do. All right, that's enough. I'm pulling you up before you and your ghosts get flattened. Welcome to the Derelict. I'm down in engineering making sure we don't blow up. Zavala's got his heart in the right place, but old Blue's about as stubborn as they come. You can't brute force this moon. The collapse messed the whole place up good. Gravity's weird down in the deep. There's pockets of air. Some places you can move safely. Others that'll crush you into a little speck. But I think I got something in my gets that'll help us out. Titan ain't my first aquatic rodeo. Go ahead and try out that prototype. Should protect you from the pressure. Well, some of it, at least. Now get on out of here. I'll fill the boss man in for you. Guardian, you're almost at the source of the distress signal. I've acquired one of Drifter's... devices. I'll be joining you momentarily. Sloan? 
Here, Commander. You're alive. Staying alive was the mission. And I always complete the mission. No wonder you called us, sister. Let's get you back home. You don't understand. That distress call wasn't for me. ally. Her name is Asa. You can communicate with it? It's complicated, sir. I get impressions, emotions, uh, ideas. She knows our true enemy. The witness came for her species, too. Discrete concepts are harder. Even more now, since this. And you're still... You? Every bit. My light is holding this corruption back, but I can hear voices whispering, demanding. It's like being tuned in to the enemy's radio. If we could strengthen my connection with Asa, I believe it would improve my ability to communicate through the noise. I got some ideas. I'll draw up some specs and drop by soon. Sloan. I'm fine, sir. And I think I'm long overdue for a debriefing. As you wish. We'll reconvene at the helm. Good to be back in contact with the Vanguard. It's an honor to serve with you. The Taken moved in quick after we lost Titan. I had to switch gears. Escape, evade, and rotate between extraction points. Survive for another day. That was the mission. I absorbed some of the Taken corruption to tap into their comms. If you can call them that. My bond with Asa proved mission critical too. I owe her my life. Now that Titan's back, the mission's changed. We need more intel on our enemy. The Witness. Drifter claims he knows a way to help Asa share that intel. Boost the signal so her message can get through. If he's right, then you're going to need some diving equipment. Thankfully, I was able to secure a pair of intact subnauticals from the Arcology's storage units. Feel free to toss out that junk Drifter gave you earlier. This is the real deal. Hey there, hero. While you were taking a dip in the methane, I detected something on the ocean floor. And it ain't native to Titan. I've seen it before. On the Glycon. On the Leviathan. On my own ship, too. An organism that's all about forming psychic connections. Seems it's growing like coral down in the depths. I'm thinking we gather it up and use it to amplify Sloane's link to the creature. I can modify my gambit equipment to bank that stuff and harness its power, but I'll need some Golden Age parts to do it. Just so happens, the arcology is full of Golden Age tech waiting to be salvaged. You help me collect it, and I'll fix up the bank. Then it's just a matter of, well, <laughs> diving into the depths of the methane sea and dredging up what Sloane needs. Oh, while trying not to drown, of course. Nothing you can't handle. So what do you say? 
Ready for another swim? Guardian, I'm picking up enemy signals in the Arcology. Sweep through and clear them out. <laughs> There's explosive rigged around the Arcology. We need to disarm them before they blow. We have maintenance that needs to be done, and this area is too dangerous for anyone but a Guardian. Let's get to work. Our salvage operations have stirred up enemy forces on the seafloor. Sending you in, Guardians. Sivu Arath is marshalling her forces. Be prepared for anything. Hey, Chief. Is it true you found yourself a suit of power armor a while back? Don't suppose you could find another? I remember that armor. Golden Age tech, very advanced. Huh. It fused itself to me, boosted my strength, speed, agility, endurance. Until it ran out of juice, that is. Then I had to rip myself out of it to keep moving. Tore up my internal organs, made a nasty mess. My ghost had a hell of a time putting me back together. So, I guess the armor had some design flaws. Still interested in scoring one? You know, I think I'll pass. This is Operation Thunderbolt. Asa has alerted us to a shelf of coral infested with a fungal spore we can use. However, it's in hostile territory. Always is, was, will be. Indeed. Forward Intel reports a Wrathborn servitor patrols the area. And it is not alone. You have two sites to hit. Deploy excavation equipment Defend and extract. Deputy Commander, Guardian, divide and conquer. Bring the Drifter what he needs. I'm reading you, Guardians. So the old man asked you to babysit? I'm your heir superiority. From aboard a Cabal cruiser? Never thought I'd see the day. Meet the Empress, then I'll hear your judgment. Fair enough. To be honest, it's just nice to be back running with the both of you. On that, we can agree. That servitor's onto us. I just met contact. Let's hustle, Guardian. It's been an age since I've seen you fight, Sloan. Had you been with us on the Dragon Hunts. You're the bait now. Guardian, you're next. Goes against all my instincts, but I'll try to make myself look delicious. Deploying drill. Let's get loud, Guardian. Drown this gift and revel in it. Kneel, that I may lay my blade across thine breast. The quiver of your heart to resonate its black edge. Get out of my head. Servitors coming in hot, Guardian. Let it take you. Then meet their challenge. <laughs> 
sites are secure and you just punched us a way out. Good. You haven't lost a step. Well, I've had a lot of dive time. But the Guardian took to the sea like a fish. Send over the submersible beacon and let's transmat this hull back to the rig. You're sure this new ally of yours is trustworthy? Hasn't let me down yet. You asked me to trust you about the Empress, trust me about Asa. An oasis in the desert. Seeds of hope buried beneath the sands. Nomads. Wanderers. Travelers. Their journey comes to an end. The first to be claimed by the deep. The first to fall victim to the witness. <gasps> So you heard all of that, huh? Hard to believe, but it's not just noise. I can understand bits and pieces of it through Asa. Zivu Arath's thirst for battle, the Witness's cold rage, the Taken's enmity. It's all in there. I started hearing it when my arm got this new paint job, but it hasn't sounded that real since. Doesn't matter. I've been through it before, and I can get through it again. Asa has vital information about the Witness. I'll do whatever it takes so she can deliver it. That's the mission, and I always complete the mission. Asa and I both need to recover before we boost our connection again. Until then, continue helping Drifter upgrade his technology. I hate to admit it, but his plan seems like it might actually work. it it just works it's not a scam if that's what you're asking ain't gonna make you put in some glimmer and pull a lever mm -hmm. see the way i look at it this has always been the plan playing the game gambit the machine the nine taking the long view you think the nine were telling you to run gambit for this that they saw everything coming and that's how they choose to prepare us? Don't know, boss. Maybe they see the future. Maybe they're just a few floors above and can see further down the road than we can. Maybe we're all just squinting at specks, looking for meaning. What I'm saying is, it works. It'll get us what we need and maybe, if we're lucky, get Sloane what she needs, too. And what is that? A win. Thank you for assisting me in this fact-finding mission, Guardian. There is much to uncover about the Vale, and your work here is indispensable. I got you on Overwatch. <laughs> Let's get to work. This Vex data is intriguing. It seems as though they're trying to access servers not currently connected to the Cloud Arc. Do we even have systems that aren't connected? <sighs> That's weird. Does it say where they're digging? Not yet, no. We need a few more data points. Uh, Guardian, let's get moving. What have we got? Interesting. 
The Vax have been attempting to breach an air gap firewall in the old Ishtar Collective Systems at Vale Containment. My initial investigation indicated those systems had been wiped in some sort of electromagnetic event. But perhaps in our haste, we overlooked something. Let us go discover what the Vex have been after. You know, ever since we defeated Kallus, I've been wondering a lot more about the Veil. I think... I think we take it for granted. It's always been here. We always assumed that the Ishtar Collective brought it with them on the Exodus ship, but... But now you question that assumption. Nezarek seemed to know something, didn't he? When we were inside the Vex network, he said something about... Savathun. My memories cast shadows of Savathun's. Echoes of the time she and I were bound by her dark magic. The more time we spend here, the clearer the outline of those shadows become. The Ishtar Collective didn't bring the Veil here, Nimbus. Savathun stole it from the Witness and left it here. Quite possibly for the Ishtar Collective to find. Why? Why would she do that? Isn't she your enemy? She is. And yet at times, she is our ally. When it is convenient to her. And in that convenience, we find common ground. Or as a friend once said, the line between light and dark is very thin. I kinda hate that. As do I. Excellent. That terminal is functional. I've sent a data mining application to your ghost. Upload it, and let's see what we can find. Geoma Essie. Personal log. Incidental. Maya arrived yesterday with the Exodus Indigo. I should be relieved, but in light of the current situation, I... I don't feel much of anything. We're presently en route from Hyperion to the terraform surface of Neptune. I'm scared. I'm so scared. We don't even know what we've lost. Comms are dead. It's just silence everywhere. We might be all that's left. Maya was right about everything. The cult, the end, how we'll survive. I hate this. Shioma Essi was one of the founders of Neomuda. There's a part of the city named after her. This is like hearing a legend. I knew of Chioma Essi and her wife, Maya Sunderish. They were Ishtar Collective researchers on Venus during the Golden Age. Is this all there is? The one log? No. There's an entire archive here. It could be the key to unraveling the mystery of the Veil. Not to cut this short, but we've got incoming. There's Taken popping up all over the courtyard and... Tormentor! There's a Tormentor heading into the facility. Guardian. Neutralize the Tormentor. We can't lose this data. is defeated and the area is secure. However, the remainder of Dr. Essie's logs are encrypted. She's using an adaptive Vex algorithm to protect them. It will take me several days to break through. Whatever this is, it must be valuable. Guardian, I recommend you check back here later to see what we've uncovered. 